This video will show you how to use the provided carrier sheet to load small or damaged photos into the Fast Photo Scanner. The carrier sheet protects your photos from scratches or damage during scanning. It should be replaced after about 500 scans. Use the carrier sheet for the following types of photos, smaller than 3 by 5, fragile or delicate, torn or ripped, wrinkled or severely curled, sticky or valuable. You should use a flatbed scanner to scan thick photos, such as photos mounted on cardboard. Using fast photo to scan these types of photos can damage the photos or the scanner. To use the carrier sheet, remove it from the packaging and take out the tissue inside. Place the photo in the carrier sheet with the top of the photo towards the labeled edge of the sheet. Ignore the front label on the carrier sheet. It won't affect your scan. Load the photo so that it fits inside the sheet. Don't try to scan photos that are larger than the carrier sheet. For sticky photos with album residue on the back, cover the sticky area before inserting it into the carrier sheet. Load the carrier sheet into the scanner with the labeled edge first and the image facing away from you. Move the feed selector to the up position and then press the blue scan button on the scanner or the start scanning button in the Fast Photo software. If prompted, add a subject and date for the scanned photo and click start scanning. After the photo is scanned, click done scanning. The scanned image will contain the photo and the carrier sheet. You can use the Fast Photo software to crop the photo appropriately. To crop your photo, select it in the Fast Photo software. The image is displayed in the preview pane. Click the edit icon, then the crop icon. In the preview pane, you can click and drag the outline to select the part of the photo you want to keep. You can zoom in and out using the slider under the preview pane. When you are satisfied with the cropped area, click apply. If you don't like the cropped photo, you can click Undo All in the menu or repeat the steps to crop the photo again. Clicking Undo All will remove all changes. For more information on using your Fast Photo Scanner, watch the other Fast Photo videos listed here.